Hello guys and today I am back with Meg's daily training. Let's have fun and let's go! Today I am back with Okay, um Bum Bam Let's see. Rusty Rahmanov Alexander against Oh Victor Tahiro 555. I played him quite some times. <laughs> in Super Blitz Arena and also I think we played in Rapid once since he was a guy which gave me rating of 2800 yes yes my memory is full <laughs> C4C5 is an interesting idea I think Oh, playing Sephiroth, Zero Twenty Three, is from Azerbaijan. Hello, good luck and smile. Sephiroth, Serifov, Serifov. Sorry, sorry. Mm, it is Abdullah Serifli. Good luck. Good luck. Let's take. Barman were defense, okay. So it's Sicilian defense, a lot in variation. Barman defense, interesting. Let's go bishop g4. Okay, so you're going for g takes f on 95. 95, okay. Here. Here e six. This knight f six. Okay, here. Uh -huh. Okay, I don't know, b5 knight here. Just don't want to allow b6. Basically, b5. Uh huh, he does this. d3. Here. <laughs> here. Wait, but his knight is stuck, no? Isn't it? Well, King D7, B5, even this I think works. Okay, wait, this, what I just take. Nice. Okay, <laughs> I don't know what was point of Bishop C2. I'll play Rook C8 then, I guess. Uh huh. Wait, <laughs> you can cancel. <laughs> okay, oops, I forgot. I forgot. Let's play bishop g6. I'm not sure if I need it, if it's good for me to trade. We'll see. Okay. This will play like rook c1. Yeah. Let's play a6. Here. Bishop there is b5. I mean, bishop here, bishop there. This, 
this b5, rook c2, bishop f8. Yeah, b5 is an interesting move, I think. <clears throat> here. And take here this. Well, let's play bishop f6, I guess. Hold on. Yeah, bishop f6, if rook here. I don't know. I mean, knight here, something like that, I guess. <laughs> don't know. Okay, play rook d1. Takes, takes, check here, here. Rook d5 takes on d3, it should be good. If king e2, there is knight c3, king d2, knight d1 takes, takes, bishop b2, my bishop may get stuck. Mm. Mm. Took it's true. Hmm. I mean, should be fine there. But what if I play bishop d4 and bishop d4 there? Take with the bishop first. I don't know. Looks fine. Maybe it's more than fine. Maybe let's play knight a7, and if rook c5, I have bishop e7. That's why knight a7, not knight e7, because... Yeah, <laughs> I just want to leave this square for, yeah, this. I'm pretty sure he'll take, take back, and then I guess the idea is to bring my knight to c4. Takes, takes. Here. I guess knight b6 here, and an attack, I guess. Then I have ideas to attack here. Uh, knight c4. No, I don't see how I can progress further. Oh, <laughs> let's try to find out. Okay, let's play like, I don't know, king c6, I think. Because king, more advanced king is better than not advanced king. So. These. Bishop f6. Or here. I want to get king to d5 and then bishop f6. Yeah, let's try bishop f6 right now. I think. Should be interesting. At least, yeah, he plays bishop g5. Maybe, maybe that wasn't a great idea. Don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Later, when I'll analyze the game. There. Wait, so takes. Here. Basically, if rook of three, I just do this. So, king g2, right. King d5. This. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I need to be careful, actually. Um, F6 is interesting. Yeah, let's try f6. Wait, 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 wait. There. Mm -hmm. Yes, f6. So basically it takes, takes, and then f5 idea. Because f7 pawn is a weakness, and <laughs> let's try to, I'm trying to get rid of this weakness. Okay. Takes, takes, yeah. 
If rook f3, just play f5, just get rid of all the weaknesses. Because right now f6 one is a weakness, so f5, I think, should be a smart move to get rid of it. Mm hmm All right. These. And can take and then knight f five, I guess. I mean, yeah, I will take for sure. Because f five I mean I think I should be better even if I would play a five, but it feels like this better. Hmm, interesting. So you want skin g4, skin g5. Kind of stuff. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm ready to five. Mm hmm. Should I play can you for a take? Let's take. <sighs> Well, can you for now it's needed, I think. Well, maybe not needed, but I think it is good to play it. Rook C3. Mm -hmm. I T2. Here. Need a four. Give me Mm, not sure about this move. Here. <sighs> Here. So my knight controls this pawn. Okay, let's go king b3. If king g4 knight e3 is the move. Maybe king b2 was better because now he has like rook a1. I don't know. 
Oh. 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 Yikes. Didn't see that. Oops. Ew. Not sure. Okay. Yikes, man, a draw. Mm. I mean, I was completely win, but with two knights, it's so sneaky. <sighs> yeah, and I left myself way too little time. Okay. Okay. GG. Mm. Did I have win? Mm -hmm. I bet it knight b5 instead of knight 2 can b3. <sighs> mm. 
and B2, and King A1. If you would give a check, then King B1, and then if you would go back, King A2, and then this, this, Rook C6, ah, huh? ah, so go until here, mm-hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. gotcha. So basically, just do this. Uh, wait, can I three? But how? Wait, I mean, it says I'm winning. But is it actually winning? I mean, okay, king before rook here, right? And king a, ah, king a4, rook b8. Uh, but what if you place king d4? Then knight b5, if rook a6, king b5, rook a1. Can be yeah, mm -hmm. and if you would go for rook a8, then knight c5, no can be four. This then there is no opportunity. Okay. I gave him this opportunity for rook e1. That wasn't great. Can I play like better? Can d3 best and then knight a3 idea. This knight e3. Mm-hmm. Takes. I need knight d6 instead of take. So basically, yeah, knight d6. He would take, I would take. And two pawns completely winning. Easier. And king before this. I mean, I again had to go for knight d6. Didn't see that because I got his skin closer. I still played well. And yeah, here b2. A blunder. I mean, I'm still better. Wait, I need knight d1. What? Knight d1. Hey. <laughs> okay. And can you see I'm winning? Mm hmm. Yeah. So, knight f4, knight d1 was needed. C, skin a2, z, here, here, here. And I tried, but yeah. Found a draw. Knight a4. What's that? c5 but that's a draw isn't it I and mean, here i catch his pawn but he has my pawn also so rook f1 he basically just stays like knight d2 rook h1 knight b3 king e3 yeah so some of his holding and rook g8 knight d4 this and then rook 8 i was thinking wait i was thinking like rook g3 doesn't it hold ah knight b3 of course yeah yeah so rook 8 I mean, I guess probably this would be a win. Uh, a, not a win, a draw. It's basically, I think, impossible to win. Is it possible? I don't know. <laughs> Never tried to mate just with two knights. And yes, this pawn is just running away. I guess I could take, but basically there is no, no possible way you can mate him. Because, yeah, that's sad. Because <laughs> 94 and then... He skims and runs away. Yes, so there is no way. <laughs> yeah, that's really, really sad that you cannot wait with two knights. Okay, let's analyze the game. So, okay. Yeah, that's a blunder. You had to go for f3. This, I had to go for bishop d6. And b4, b6, and do like this, yeah. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. This, this. Yeah, you had to go for b5, try to push. I was thinking b6, I could just take. Could I? Yes, yes, rook a1, rook b1, yeah. This, this. Knight 3, okay. Yeah, and bishop d3, blunder. Wait, that's a miss win. I had to go for bishop d6, trade the bishop. Uh -huh. And then rook b1, blunder. He again had to go for b5. It would be equal. King d7, and yeah, I mean, I'm completely winning. Finding good moves. I mean, maybe that wasn't so great, but still. f6, these. I am two knights and a pawn versus a rook. These. Yeah, it was just technical. But he left, I don't know why it's sold for so long. Yeah, here just knight d6 would be an easier win. And basically that, f5, just play knight c3, this, and then I'm mating him with knight e3. 
and basically sucks a rook, it seems like he's fine. I cannot catch him, but I don't mind, <laughs> I don't even care catching him. I just made, so king b4, I mean, it wasn't bad. I had to go for knight e d6. So basically, I don't care that his king goes here, because push, and then push, and then if he takes, I push this, and somehow try to win, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, rook a1, this, this. I had to go for king a2, well, I don't know, yeah, just go here, and then king a4, king d4, there is knight b5, which works, right? Basically, rook b8, he also goes for knight b, I also go for knight b5. This, yeah, two knights are so sneaky endgame. In time trouble, you just sometimes can't calculate, so I had to give check, then play king a3, and give a check here, and then rook b8 to play... Knight b6, I can knight, yeah. And then here, yeah, that's a brilliant move. That's hard to find. And then here, knight c4, protecting the knight. And rook h8, knight d5. Here, here. And then king a2, b1, that's winning. Yeah, and b2 was a blunder. I lost all advantage. I had to go for king a1 and still try. As you can see, I analyzed quite a bit, but basically, yeah. <laughs> rook g6. No, wait. I had to go for king a for here. Maybe five is a bad move. Even though it says best, it is not best. You can just take and then king c2 or rook g1. So basically here, king a4 or king a3 is the best. Don't look at this. And then basically Stockfish understands that maybe five is threatened. Yeah. And you know, f4 was mistake. Knight d1 is still at chances. And I guess I'm just winning. Yeah. So knight, I need to go for knight d1, then sacrifice a knight. Yeah, that's insane. <laughs> and then this, this, oh, this, this, this here takes knight e2 blunder to go for knight e4, but I am relatively sure, yeah, Stockfish gives <laughs> this light knight d4, but king f2 there, we just repeat. And if I try, yes. Yeah, ah, yeah, that's actually a nice move, king g3, look. Uh, and then king g3, knight d2, keep rook on first rank, and then just advance with skin, and that's a draw. Yeah. So, basically, rook g8, great move, and then it is a draw. So, crazy game, <laughs> I was completely winning all game, but didn't manage to win and draw the things in game. Seri, 4-0-23. But did you make a brilliant move, though? There. Wait, what? A rook c4, brilliant, okay. <laughs> cool. I mean, is it? Yes, it is. Ooh, I thought it's some easy draw. Yeah, like in a2, I think it would work, and I just take on b2. I think just capturing b2 would also be fine, so I'm sure it's brilliant, but okay. Um. So, okay, last book move. So, e6, great move. And here, I need to develop the bishop first. Here, um, I need to go for trading. This is great move. Then I played a bit very, very well. Uh, ta -ta -ta -ta. Yeah, bishop e7 traded. I need maybe to be careful, try to keep the bishop. I don't know. He sacrificed a pawn, that was cool. Then this. B2 blunder. Was this king a2? Or king a1? Yeah, king a2 is fine. Here I had to go for knight d1 and then knight b5. Uh, this. This. And here knight d2 a blunder. I had to go for knight a4. Well, it still would be a draw. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And here, yeah, draw. Mm -mm. Yeah, gg. <laughs> so a lot of blunders, as you can see, 3 2 2 for me and 1 3 nil. Nil 1 3 for him, okay. Let's see the game of of, of Grandmaster Hovitzer 14 against Grandmaster Jonas Beer. And yeah, <laughs> I'll take a small break, see you in a minute.
Hello and I'm back. All right, let's get the PGN. Download. There we go. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, I need to be careful and play kinny one, kinny two, kinny three. I need to do this ladder kind of stuff. Okay. Um, let's flip the board. Okay, so yes, yeah, it's somewhat main line. I guess G takes F. It's also an interesting move. So Bishop D one. These here, Bishop E three. Mistake F three was better. Yeah, so basically just F three. These then G five sacrifices. So the Bishop doesn't control. D five. Ooh, that isn't a great move. Basically, bishop of two, bishop d6, h3 here, g4. Oh, that's crazy. Hold on. Uh, knight f5, right? These. And then play king d7 and compensation after h3 here. That's insane. Uh, here, here, and compensation. Mm -hmm. Okay. E6, A3, that's a mistake. So, yeah. Wait, no, it was fine. Yeah, bishop e3 was a mistake. This, that was a mistake for me. I had to go for bishop d6, b4, b6, d5, takes, 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 takes. Here, here, wait, I'll sleep. Okay, G1 trying to put pressure on D5. This, 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 Bishop E5. I'm slightly better. I have two knights, but he has a rook and a pawn, so it's unclear. I'm better. Let's even say, so B4, mm, this, Bishop D3, a mistake. I had to go for B5. Uh, here, here, A6. And yeah, basically, he had to sack a knight, and here would be just slightly better position is so weird okay bishop d6 mistake i had to go for bishop g6 and basically takes takes b5 here b6 now he has this but i have knight c4 this would be one here and yeah i'm basically better well here it is equal but after king six for example all right and here i'm better because basically after bishop a2 there is rook c5 and then some move so rook b1 blunder he had to go for b5 this this and well h4 and it would be equal so yeah rook b1 king d7 this so it was all good here. So king d5 was first in accuracy. Here it says I had to go for knight d5. And wait, why did he have to? I mean, yeah, I guess he's just caught it, but why can't he go like king e2? Yeah, that's weird. Here, and then here, look f3, f6, these. I mean, I'm better winning, of course, but, but yeah, I don't know. <laughs> um, promote. Uh, G4, F6, mistake. Knight, C8. And if you play Rook, F3, Knight, there. So, this, King, D4. Yeah, it is completely win. But, Knight, C8, Rook, H3. And if Rook, H7, that pawn is basically not needed because I just take here, so yeah. G takes F inaccuracy from him. He had to go for Rook, H3. Try to create problems, but after F takes G, Rook, H7, Knight, H3, Rook here. King, D6 here, Knight, C2. Yes, it's completely winning. Uh, well, Knight, G, wait, Rook, I need to, oops. <laughs> King, F1, Knight, C2. It's winning. Um... Gf g5 inaccurate wasn't really an inaccuracy. Kidney 4 inaccuracy is the best move, okay. This knight f4, that this here. That was an inaccuracy. I had to go for knight d3. f4, king d4 there. Take the pawn, and yeah, I have three passers, that's completely win. Rook a1 is a mistake. He had to go for f4. Then king e4 here, knight d3, and yeah, I'm just 
take in every single pass you pastor he just cannot stop me so this disease can be three mistake the best one for skin d3 so we said you have knight a3 yeah, i don't know why i didn't do it because after king b3 i allowed him rookie one this and um, slowly but surely getting better and king d3 he's forced because he's rookie strapped so this and it's just one after knight c okay rookie one here knight cd6 is a mistake i'd go for knight ed6 the so wait yeah here yeah so knight cd6 wasn't a mistake i guess knight cd6 was a great move actually okay yes that was actually a mistake because rook 8 is not good, he could just play king g4. Yeah, that's why I didn't want this knight, and then I mean push, push, here, and rook a1, he's in time. That's equal, so, not slightly better, but equal. Rook a1, king c3, a mistake. I had to go for knight c3, and if he would go like king e3, then go knight c4, uh, king c4. And then, yeah, spawn is somewhat unstoppable. And basically, if he tries to stop it from here, f knight d5. And then, yeah, just or take or push. Mm -hmm. King is 3 b4. Here can be 2 this, this. Here, b2, mistake. Well, that was actually a blunder. Uh -huh. uh, I had to go for king a2. And rook a6. Well, king is 3 rook a6. This. King a4 here. This. And yeah, <laughs> coordinate my knights well. And now I'm just winning. Mm -hmm. Okay, king d3 here. That was a mistake. Uh, king e2 was the best. And then, yeah, basically, not allowing knight d1. And that's just a draw. Knight f4 was a blunder. Yeah, knight d1. And I'm still winning after playing king d2, knight b5, king a2 here, there, knight a6. And that's just. Winning so king d3 a great move this here This here. Yeah, that's the only move otherwise. It's just lost this can be four g6 92 mistake best move was 94, but still after that it's just a draw and this is and um, Yep, your game was drawn by insufficient material. Good and the draws that game Serfi Serif of zero twenty three. Um here search games. What did it do? Hold on. It's close chess but it's just think it will be the easiest way and reopen it. <laughs> yeah, instead of deleting Clicked something else. There we go. There we go. Okay. Let's go here. Tactics trainer. Still some puzzles. Win h7, win g8 idea. Yes, king f7, knight f5. Win h7. Yes, win h7. Now knight f5, now rook e7, now rook e6, and queen g6. Okay, next. Let's see. Twenty six. I knight six takes with the bishop. Queen d six, king g seven, queen e six. But what if he takes with the pawn? No. 
Yeah, I was thinking rook e6, but okay, I had to go for queen f, oh yeah, queen f3, just sacrifice a queen, okay, let's see, bishop e4, if rook e5, I have to see there, 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 Queen g5, queen h6, wait, rook e5, f takes c, queen g5, king h8, queen h6, queen f8, queen h7 threats. So if rook e5, he doesn't take in place like queen d6, there is rook g5, king h8, rook h5. So I think rook e5 is great. Yes, this and queen h6, okay. Oh, I had this puzzle, wait, can c4 there? Yes, it is, can c4. Here, 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 and here. I think I had this puzzle like the day before yesterday or something, and I had this puzzle for sure also. And rook h7. Okay, that's weird. Puzzles are repeating, <laughs> but okay. Plus 41. Okay, cool. Um, let's do this. Uh, here, 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 here. And random side. Okay, playing with white pieces. Start off with d4 and then c4. g3. b3. Okay, that's a bit weird. Okay, bishop g2. Castle Queen C two mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's play Rook D one. This Can develop my knight because bishop is there. Let's see, ninety five takes ninety four. Mm -hmm. Um, I think bishop three is fine. He cannot take us if rook d eight. Uh, yeah. This s takes and queen b2 is interesting, yeah, that's right. Queen b2, here. Yeah, let's take. Mm -hmm. Okay. Queen C five, Queen D four. Okay. Ay 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 ay. This. Look here. 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 Alright, these. Let's try like knight a3. I mean, not the best development, 
but of the night but otherwise 21 would be i think even scarier i'm not exactly sure if it would be more scarier but yeah okay <laughs> h3 and maybe i need a dragon in eight. no because oh yeah okay i think there is a little issue uh, basically rook f8 knight f3 and then it sounds like forced mate this mm, what if i do this ah that's a nice move yeah nice move basically just saying move your please mm -hmm. so what was the mistake he takes f takes takes mm, don't know Mm-hmm, and he promotes. Hmm... I'm not sure, right? Maybe it was... Yeah, knight e5 didn't seem like a great move. Maybe I need to play like bishop d5 and then knight bd2. Because knight d5 will make my pawn structure worse. So, I would guess that... Probably... What? Yeah, probably... I need knight e5 for some mistake, I need like bishop g5 for bishop f4, I don't know, yeah. And then basically, if we take c, I just take, if d takes c, I just take if knight e4, if knight e4, just knight bd2, for example. Okay, begin f2. Here. Yeah. James Tuxery, level 7, GG. Thank you, GG. Yeah, well. It's just slightly worse. Need queen b2 immediately, sack a pawn, which is not really a sack, I have like rook d4. And a disease. Knight d1, c1 isn't, queen c2 isn't good, but queen c1, this knight 2 would be better, but yes, I mean, yeah, knight e5 wasn't good, bishop of 4 top line, yeah, or, whoa, way 4 wait, what, e4, what's the idea, idea is bishop 3 or a5, or, okay, um, this, so knight 5 yeah, I need to go for a4, or bishop c3, and if he takes, I take, this play knight e5, yeah, makes sense, and then here it does this, and if he takes, takes knight e5, then e4, bye bye to his knight. So this, this, he takes d was another knight say to go for queen b2, no wait, yeah, basically queen b2, like f6, then take, take, and I feel like rook f1 move. Why well, didn't have it here? Well, I did. That was like that wasn't good here because position is more open and he can take and I'm like queen c5. So I had to go for bishop f3. And this queen d4, I mean he would be better. But still I think it is kinda holdable after knight d2. And the rest wasn't good. So mistake bishop f3. Yeah, okay. And now let's play in level six. Okay, playing with black piece, he starts off. He starts the sense of with e4. Mm, c5, means c6. Wow, he's going for close Italian? That's unusual. Wow, okay. b5. We should b7. Ooh. I'm surprised. Wow. He never played it. Insane. I mean, maybe he did play it once. Wait, did he blunder? No, I don't think I did. If I take. Oh, if I, yeah. Um. He takes F. He takes F. Takes. 
Okay, he takes a castle. I mean, I'm not sure if it's good to castle, but well, usually castle is the thing you have to do. So yeah, knight c6. Here b3. Okay, let's go knight e5. This so he protects g4 pawn, but I have something like knight d5 here, I think, which is interesting. This bishop f6, but then he has g5. What? I don't know, h6 is looking interesting, but he went in g5, I think. This now bishop f6. Here we take c. Okay, took with the bishop. Okay. So you can take with the knight. And then... Hmm. I think I'll take with knight and I can play like, play like knight g4, winning the pawn. But I'm not sure if I want the pawn or maybe I want to play d5 and then win the pawn. I'll, I'll see Nick. If d5 he has like rook f4, and then knight c6, yeah, maybe I would like to play d5 first. Maybe I won't win a pawn, but, but we'll see. Okay, rook f4 is a move he goes for. Hold on, now knight g4, if he'll take with queen, bishop c3, rook c1, bishop d2, fork. So I may win an exchange, so wait, this, d5, and knight g4. Take with the rook, bishop three there, and okay, it looks good. So I think here I will take. Okay, it takes with the rook, bishop c three. Wait, what? Uh, wait. So, <clears throat> yes, rook on e one, right? Yeah, so queen a1, bishop a1, queen a1, queen f6, he takes on f6, and that's lost because of pain. So I have to go for f6, knight f4, queen d7, or rook e8. I'm not sure, it looks really risky and scary. So I think the move I will go for is queen f6. Now I take in the a1 rook, and queen f5 is the idea. Okay, these, let's go for... Oh, and bishop here. No, we cannot take now. Let's go bishop d4 back. Now, I want to take his yes, queen f3. Okay. Rook a8, rook e5 idea. Because if queen d5, rook e5, I don't know. This, I can take. I'm not blundering anything. I can do chicken's life opening today. <laughs> um... Well, yeah, I think I can take, and knight d5 takes on f3 and then rook e5. Okay, yes, takes. And then, and then, play rook e5. If knight f6, king h8, d7, rook e3. So, yes, this, we said yeah to get his knight away, and then play rook e3, rook f8. Kind of stuff. Your king h8, and if knight d7, there is rook e3. Yeah, rook e3 check. Here, I mean, I can play rook c8, but I think maybe rook d8 is going to be better. And I'd say if I just take and play like rook d d3 or something, I'm not sure. Eh, maybe it's not good, okay? But I take on c5. This I'll take rook d d3. I don't know, looks good. Scary rooks. Okay, rook b3, can have two, e uh, rook on e3, okay. <laughs> um, rook e6, rook here, uh-huh, yeah, nice idea, he wants to try to go to 7th rank, creating problems. I'll give a check on f6. 
Then I'll play... Wait, I think I broke H3 here. Which can be scary if he doesn't react quick enough. Yes, this. Rook G8. This. Uh, rook G6, sorry. Not rook G8. Yeah, that. Mm -hmm. Rook F6 takes, takes. I think rook F6 and if we'll trade it will be good. Rook D6 and G7. I think it should work. Okay, place rook d8, king h7. We take, I take. We are rook d6. Well, I think I'll play king g7 just so this pawn will not hang. Now I will play rook h2. And rook a2 here. So basically, you always want to stay behind the pawn. It's the case here, a5, a4, here, take, def and f and h4. I think I have to cut his king, first of all. King f5, so if rook b5 is in king g4, if this, then... Wait, king g4, this, f rook here. So you can give check. I think king g4 is a good move, unless I'm blundering. Here, let's go rook g3. Check. Here, rook here. Here, rook h2. Got in his king once more. King g3. Here, rook h1, king d2, f3. Yes, rook h1, king d2, f3, rook g8. So rook h1, f3. Here, king f4, and then push idea. So king f4, rook g7, f2. Yeah, I think that should be good. Wait, uh, king here. This. I mean, I can just to be sure I can play f5, I think, but I think f2, rook f7 here, king e2, f rook e1, and that's good. And this, 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 rook g7, I just go here, so I think I may as well just push. Yeah, rook c8, I promote. That's a win. Mm, that's not rush. If I would take, that would be a stalemate. I was like, wait, why is it just sucking a rook? It's unusual. <laughs> nice trap. This here. And queen's eight. Cool. That felt like a nice game. Danilo from Algeria, welcome. So it is 1785 members, just 15 more, and a tournament as well members. So if you haven't joined it yet and you want a tournament, feel free to join. So 3 for 1. Yeah, they play great in open. 85 was not good, I had to go for h6. Yeah, preventing g5. I can see the point. These. The g4 was a mistake, I just had to go for rook 8 and just slowly but surely apply some pressure. This he had to go for rook c1, and I basically got the lead. Maybe didn't play ideally. Rook f6, blunder to go for rook g1, rook a1. Because if he would take, take rook d6, but wait, we got similar in the game, didn't we? Ah, only he would have king closer, yes, and it's hard to win. This had to go for king g6, again, had to go for king f2, and basically after rook a6, I was winning. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Uh, first mistake was h6. Here I to go for rook e8. Here play rook g1, rook a1. And here play king g6. Uh, whoops. Flip the board. For him e5. Yeah, and basically takes. This isn't good. Because bishop h3. And I'm just a pawn up in much better position. So he would play king g2. And yeah, he would apply pressure. I see. Here queen f3 was interesting. But no. Queen may get stuck. See B threats. It's scary. Let's see. Ninety four. Yeah. Um, B three. I guess he was trying to save his knight, but his knight wasn't really in danger. So G five again. Here he had to go for rook C one. I think applying pressure. 
Um. Okay. Let's see. Rook g3 is an interesting move. Trying to trade rooks, but no. Um, rook a5, no, not really. B4, no. Rook f4, yes, so rook f2 can make a shield somewhat. And king f2. Okay, so I think I'm going to finish stream. Stream was saying great. If not counting this game where I was completely winning, but. But I didn't manage to win. <laughs> but nice thing that at least I got the lesson <laughs> that, yeah, I need to be more careful when I have two knights. I need to be more maneuver. Because, yeah, knight d1, I need to be more. I mean, I think I was aggressive enough, so I wasn't aggressive. It's not the right word. I just needed to make my king close to my knights. Because my knights were just alone, and then king alone also couldn't do much. Then. Then yeah, tactics were great and blindfold was also kind of nice. So if you liked the stream, if you did, then feel please share your chest, special and comment teams. I have 1085 members, thank you all very, very much. If you join more, it's now we show 1,100 members. So feel free to join, I will be very happy. And also please share your club, you can find club. Now my club, they are 169 members, thank you all very, very much. So 31 members, and now we show 200 members. So feel free to join, I will be very happy. And yeah, thank you for following on the chest on YouTube. And on Twitch and as usual, please like button and subscribe to me. And please answer your please little chest club at home. And also, please my Discord to get notifications when I start doing Twitch and when I post videos on YouTube. Link in the description. And yeah, bye bye. Come on, guys. See you soon. See you tomorrow. Stay fun. See you. Stay cool.